guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel you're very very much welcome please do not forget to subscribe hit the notification button and be part of this beautiful family and if you're my returning to be my day one you already know what time it is so please say it with me baby welcome and thank you for tuning in again and without wasting any of your time guys in today's video we are reviewing this worst kiss unit that i am absolutely absolutely obsessed with guys this hair is so soft it's so soft and be in mind i did not do much into it like i literally did nothing to it except straightening it installing it and just styling it it took heat very well um, it's an HD lace as you can see what lace where where okay but yeah man no shedding whatsoever and I am very very much impressed so I thought I should just jump into this video and show you guys the installation how I'm, I'm rocking this unit and I hope you guys love this video as much as I did making it enjoy the video any details by the way before I forget any details about this hair the link and all the good stuff will be on the description box um, they have a variety of hair of course they have curls straight body wave um, 613 hair bangadi hair whatever you into just in case you're not into black hair okay there is a whole lot of variety for you to check out so yeah enjoy the video bye hey guys i am reviewing whiskey's hair they were kind enough to send me this beautiful beautiful unit it's a 20 inch it's a medium cap size and it's an hd lace 180 density inside there was a wig cap and now i'm just showing you inside um the wig is a 13 by 6 which is very nice there's three combs inside um also the lace is very very much hd as you can see um the scalp is melting on my skin tone what you mean i'm checking for shedding there was no shedding at all and right now i'm just um, installing this wig and i'm just putting my wig cap and doing the bold cap method which is my favorite especially when i want a long lasting um installation i'm going in with my got to be spray and you guys know we're gonna use my head dryer just cool it so that we can lay down that cap and now i'm just cutting off the lace that i don't need while i eat so far so good and now i'm taking my razor i need to do better and get proper um razors because no this is ghetto this is not nice okay but yeah that is me just cutting off the lace that i don't need and just working on my wig and now i'm using my fit me um foundation in shade nutmeg just to blend my cap with my skin tone so that it looks like scalp okay that's why we call it bold head method i'm going in now with my ghost bond glue this glue is everything you need i kid you not and i'm just going to be applying that a little bit on the edge of my cap and on my skin um away from my hairline of course um and now while i'm waiting it for it for it to clear i'm just blending that foundation on my lace because we needed matching my skin tone okay i'm going back in with my second application because i want it to last a bit longer this is what i do when i want um a lasting longer installation especially when i know i will be having this wig on for days now that is me just putting in the wig and trying to glue it down to my wig cap and i'm using my comb just to press it down a bit making sure it's all secured looking nice but look at how soft and how easy this comb it is i mean this hair it is to comb i mean look at that and now i'm also using my hair dryer in between because i really want to make sure um the lace is glued down right and now i am just going to go in and cut my lace off and clean the excessive glue that i don't need and i'm using my rubbing alcohol you can get this from this cam if you are in south africa um also going back in with my got to be spray just to make sure and lay it 
even more because like I said I want it really secure done because I'm gonna keep it for days and I'm using my hair dry as well in cool air and now I'm going for edges you guys know my edges I don't do edges anywhere else except those part of my front or rather my what my scalp and I'm cutting off the hair I don't need I'm preparing everything for most yam and now I'm applying my mousse. I'm using the anti jakey mousse, the one I usually use. You guys know that mousse is my favorite. And now I'm using my elastic band just to lay everything down and make sure everything is secured and in place. And I'm going back in with my hair dryer because I have trust issues. I really have trust issues. I feel like it's going to lay even more if I put hair dryer on, right? Now I'm taking my wax stick from LS and i am using my hot comb just to brush away and lay down some flyaways that are not needed and also to kind of give it like a slick look i feel like if you really want a slick look it's either you use your mousse if not you use your wax stick but i really prefer a wax stick and i'm doing a side part today because i feel like i am bored of doing middle part so we're doing side part and we're parting that hair using the wax stick and the hot comb okay but look at that look at and the and the wax stick kind of gives this hair a bit of a shine not that it needed it but ma'am please look at that another thing i am straightening this hair using my tony and guy straightener and it took heat very well look at it slick straight bone straight and that is me i am done look at my edges where what scalp where that lace is secured is resting i mean in peace ma'am but look at how nice the hair is it's flowy it's sleek it's bone straight it's amazing it's shiny and i did not put any serum by the way it it, it is shiny it's really really good it's beautiful it's soft and i am very much in love with it and i'm gonna just show you guys quickly um where this hair sits as well it sits right um, um on top of my boobs but it really does pass my boobs this is a 20 inch and i think for a 20 inch this hair is quite quite long and that is it from me guys i hope you guys enjoyed this review thank you guys for watching i love you guys so much